Hey folks, so the uh, premise of this video is you woke up tomorrow and all of a sudden you had $20 million in the bank. Let's just say you won the lotto, your uncle died, you happened to figure out that you owned an ancient Chinese vase and it was worth that much. So now you get to buy all the cool high tech you want. Now we're going to keep this simple. I'm going to tell you what I would buy. Only five things. We're not going to go through everything I would buy. What I want people to do is give me some comments and tell me what they would buy. So, for the purpose of this video, you get to buy two laptops, a desktop, a monitor, and a smartphone. Put it in the comments below and oh, which ones and why. And we'll just see how it works out, what it compares. And do the math and tell us what you came up with. So first off, and we, that's why we're sitting here. First thing I would buy, a Dell XPS 13. Right here, only $1,487. So we're going to call that $1,500 on the old calculator here. And we're going to move on to the next item. This one I'd buy because it will edit videos for me much quicker than anything I currently own. And it's more than good enough. And I don't care if it plays games. So, next, the Chewy Lapbook Air. This is my carry around, take everywhere. Got a backlit keyboard, 14.1 inch, so it's bigger. I can see it better, I got lousy eyes. And we'll get the job done for day-to-day -day tasks. Hell, I could probably even edit videos on this. And right now it's only $340 million in gear best, I might mention that. That's number two. So let's just say at this point we're talking three fifty. We're up to eighteen hundred and fifty. Plus and somewhere in here I'm probably gonna screw up the calculator, but that's okay. Now next I need a desktop. Now I don't need a fancy desktop. You might want to buy a gaming desktop. It's fine might want to buy something that has screaming fans. I would merely upgrade what I currently have to the CI3 270 attack because I'm so happy with the CI3 23 I have. I can move my hard drive over or my SSD and get some new RAM. And I've already covered the costs in doing this because the other item would be a new monitor right there. I'm good with that, 109 bucks, cut full 1080. I'm good with that. And I already did a video here about this. I will put that in a card up above one of those little info things you see. If you want to watch it, tell you all about it and how much it would cost you total. Roughly $420. Oh, okay. So, now we have to add that. And that covers the monitor and the new desktop. And some RAM and maybe a new SSD. And we're up to 2200. And then the last thing on the list is a new cell phone. Well, in reality, the only thing I need is right here. Four gig of RAM, fingerprint reader, Decent display, takes good pictures. I use a cell phone to communicate and do stuff on the web. Probably wouldn't if I suddenly had $20 million to be recording videos for the guys at work that currently work for. They can find somebody else. That's not my problem. I'd show them how to do it, but 
I would use that phone probably to record a lot of my in-studio videos. And we're not even going into all the extra stuff I would buy then, you know, to get my YouTube channel really going good. But what I want to know is five things. Laptop one, laptop two, your desktop. Which monitor do you pick? And which new cell phone do you buy? Smartphone, whatever. You get one choice on each. Put them in the comments and why you would buy it. And not just because, oh, it's the best. Give some reasoning behind each one. And if you don't need the second laptop, don't throw it in there. That's fine. And that is all I have for today. This is just a curiosity thing. What would be good for you? And would you spend as little as I'm looking at? Because you can buy laptops that cost more than this. And I'd have two laptops, a new desktop a new monitor and so and they'd all get the job done because you're not John Ford and recording John Wayne in a movie in Monument Valley so you don't need the world's best camera you don't need the world's best laptop unless you're processing enormously large videos but when I say you don't need, I, I'm talking to the general public. You want you one with a graphics processor so you can do 4K videos and all that crap. That's fine. Let us know why. And that's all I have for tonight. I would actually like some comments for once. Thank you. Oh. Okay, before I go, and because somebody will nitpick this, including the cost of the mobile g3 we're looking at 2670 now we're really done thanks a lot please leave comments i'm really curious to see how crazy people would go